Hi, I'm Miss Hearn. Let's get started. How high is a tree that, that should say casts, not cases, <laughs> that casts a 33 foot shadow at the same time a seven foot post casts a shadow, which is 12 feet long. This is a technique that people can use to find the heights of buildings or mountains or whatever we want to find the height of, or we can't just measure it with a tape measure. This actually involves similar triangles because when the sun casts a shadow, on two different objects, it's going to cast it at the same angle. So I'm going to first draw my tree. This is my tree. And it casts a 33 foot shadow. So the sun is shining down, causing the shadow on the ground, right? And this shadow is 33 feet long. And um, we don't know the height of this tree. That's actually the unknown we're looking for. So I'm going to call that X. At the same time, there is a seven foot post and the sun is shining on it at the same angle and it casts a shadow of 12 feet. Since this angle is the same as this angle and also they're both, I'm assuming, going up at a right angle from the ground, we have angle angle. That means that we have similar triangles. So the sides should be proportionate. So using the technique of comparing the two sides of the first triangle to the two sides of the second triangle, we would have X over 33 is equal to seven over 12. So we would multiply, cross multiply to solve for X and we get 12 X equals, let's see, what is 33 times seven? 231. Okay, and then we would divide both sides by 12 to get what x is equal to. And so dividing 231 by 12, we get 19.25 feet. And by the way, in my math lab, it's going to tell you to how many decimal places to uh, put your answer. So pay attention to that. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please remember to give it a thumbs up. That helps other students to find the video.